Yo, what's up guys? As you know, the hunt has been going on Roblox and every single day for this event, Roblox has released a brand new item. If you join the hub game and you look to the right side of your screen, you'll see there's an item that says limited time offer and there's a timer on the bottom showing how long it's actually on sale for. So this one is about to go off sale in 16 minutes and 30 seconds, but there's already been a total of five different items that have come out and they've all been pretty expensive. Plus they're all on sale for only a short amount of time. And I know a lot of people have been wondering if these items are actually gonna be going limited or not. When they first came out above them, they said limited instead of limited time, leading a lot of people to think that it actually would go limited, but then eventually Roblox changed it. But still, there definitely still is a chance that any of these items could go limited. I mean, they are all pretty expensive. This one is 700 Robux, just for this little cloak right here. The Vault Explorer's Respirator's Mask was like 900 Robux just for this mask thing. The Vault Sword Pack was 36,000 Robux. The Wings of the Infinite were also pretty expensive at 1,900. And the Infinite Vault Star Glasses were 1,000 Robux. So all these items are extremely expensive. And usually the only items on Roblox that are that expensive are limited items. And these are only on sale for, a few, for one day. So that means that these items are limited time for sure. However, as far as being tradable and being resellable, I really don't think that any of these items are gonna become limited. Because if they were, Roblox probably wouldn't change the title of them from limited to limited time. I think Roblox was just trying to get some extra money by making a bunch of these items really expensive and hoping that people would actually buy them for the outrageous prices that they put on them. Like, I'm sorry, but I'm not spending 700 Robux on a Vault Thief's cloak. It doesn't even look good. And not to mention that most of these items are just retextures of old Roblox items, like the Vault Sword Pack that is 36,000 Robux. is literally just a copy of another item that's 150 Robux. So personally, I would recommend against buying any of these items. Unless you like how they look, then that's a different story. But I wouldn't tell you to buy them if you're actually trying to resell them or trade them off eventually. I don't think they will be tradable. As you guys can see, personally, I haven't bought any of them besides the Infinite Vault Star Glasses, because I actually liked how these looked. But all the rest of them, I decided not to buy because they're too expensive and I don't think they're going to go limited. However, there was another item that came out recently that is supposed to go limited, the Skadoosh emote from the Kung Fu Panda 4 movie. This item was supposed to go limited. It's been over a month now and it still hasn't gone limited. So I'm not really 100% sure what's gonna happen with this item. Obviously with the limited items recently, Roblox has just not been doing anything at all. They promised that this item would go limited. They promised that these items would go limited at first. Then of course, there's also the items that you can win as prizes from the event. There's eight different items that were released as part of the hunt that you can earn for free if you finish all the challenges, like the Infinite Hunter's Crown or the Infinite Hunter's Hood and all the rest of these items that they put out. I don't really think that these items are gonna go limited either. I think definitely if the ones that are on sale aren't going limited, these ones for sure are not gonna go limited. So I don't really bet that these will, but I recommend finishing the challenges if you want any of these items, because they will never go on sale and you'll never be able to get them again. They just won't be resellable and tradable. And there's so many items that we really expect to go limited, but so far this year, we have not seen any new limited items. I mean, even the Golden Clockwork headphones, I think a lot of people thought would go limited, but obviously that hasn't happened yet. And these items I don't think are ever gonna go limited. I don't know if Roblox is gonna release any limited anytime in the future. But at least there are still are a ton of limited items on Roblox that you could buy, sell, and trade. So you don't have to worry about all the new ones. There still are some really good ones that you can get. But let me know what you guys think of this lack of limiteds in the hunt event. Personally, I really wish they released some, but obviously they haven't. Maybe they will in the future for this event, but they haven't yet. So let's wait and see. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a like and subscribe. Peace.